you don't find anything like this on the market yeah. anymore. It will be quite a bumpy flight. This fancy bicycle steering wheel. So many coffin flies that you do. Yeah. Just arrived here in front of the Legacy 650E and this is all about the video today. So let's go, come along. We are already rolling. Um, overall, the experience was great. You come 30 minutes before the flight, go into the terminal, get some coffee, then you get passed through the security and uh, driven directly to the plane. And then we were able to check it out and uh, that was just five minutes ago. Already in the air only 35 minutes yeah. after arriving at the airport. It was uh, quite a steep climb. So we are flying today from Zurich out of Switzerland uh, to Karlsruhe, which is in the southwest of Germany. Uh, flight time is around 35 minutes only. They are expecting a cruise altitude of 19,000 feet and the cruise speed is around 312 knots. So it will be quite a fast flight. It's quite windy today, uh, wind from the west was around 30 knots uh, when I checked it before, so it will be quite a bumpy flight maybe. Let's check out how the legacy will do in such windy conditions. Remo is figuring out how the in-flight entertainment system works. It's all to have Bluetooth. Yeah, and um, there is also Wi-Fi. This is the call sign of the aircraft. So we try to figure out how to connect with Wi-Fi and um, we will soon get some champagne for sure. Let's talk a bit about the fleet of Flair Hamburg. Um, they have quite a huge fleet starting with around two Falcon 7X. And they have more than 20 Legacy 650 and 600 and 650E. We are sitting in one of it and uh, as you can see they have very nice cabin. And what's very funny about uh, Air Hamburg is they have very funny call signs. They have one with a call sign of uh, Delta Boss, Delta Ball, uh, Beer. Which yeah, is Delta Beer. Delta Beer. So I think they have very good connection to the authority. <laughs> In these aircraft, they have uh, space for 13 passengers. I'm sitting, I see here now, on the divan. Which will have space for three people. And for sure, there is also a night configuration. So you can change this divan into a bed. And you also can change these two seats into a bed. Five minutes later. So in the end, you will have six comfortable beds. So if you want to fly longer trips with six people, this will be the perfect uh, configuration that everyone has his own bed. They even have a bathroom here, very spacious. And there is also a direct entry into the cargo department. So if you have luggages and you need them during the flight, you can easily access it through this door in the back. So Fritz, thank you very much for flying us to Karlsruhe. It was a very challenging flight, I think, with so yeah. much wind. <laughs> Something different every now and then, but it's flying in nice weather is boring as well. So Okay, so how was your day so far? You came from Moscow, right? Yeah, we flew out of Moscow this morning, out of the cold, then into Zurich and now to Baden-Baden and now the day is over. So can you tell us a little bit about the Legacy 650E? Well, it's basically an old Embraer 135. Yeah. Uh, based on the Embraer 145, which is slightly longer than this one. Then Embraer decided to make a private jet out of this and designed the Legacy 600, um, which has four additional tanks compared to the, um, to the Embraer 135. After that, they decided to modernize it a little bit and give it an even more range of approximately another 800 miles and um, put another tank in it and created an aircraft that was called the Embraer Legacy 650. They wanted to make it a little bit more fancy. They designed the Embraer Legacy 650E, which is um, more or less the same. So how, how is it to fly? 
Oh, it's, it's nice. It's different to fly compared to other aircraft. I was flying a Bombardier Challenger 850 before, mm -hmm. and then suddenly you're sitting in this one where you don't have the usual yoke, the U-shaped yoke. Now you yeah. have this fancy bicycle <laughs> steering wheel, <laughs> which in the beginning is quite quite difficult. It's, it takes some time to get used to it. Um, the aircraft itself is great. I mean, the range is close to 4,000 miles, which is something which is quite unique on the market. You don't find anything like this on the market yeah. anymore with, with that range. But it's it's a cool aircraft to fly, I like it. Yeah, and also as a passenger, it's very spacious mm -hmm. and it's very quiet. I was, uh... Yeah, it is, yeah. And you have one of the biggest cargo holes in the world in here. I mean, yeah. you can fit a coffin <laughs> in there. My, I think my record is 56 suitcases. Why we, why, why we always hear coffin <laughs> regarding uh, cargo it's, spaces? <laughs> but it's it's a major thing nowadays. Yeah, really? I mean, you, there are so many, so many coffin flights that you do, yeah. especially um, transporting, yeah, dead bodies back to, to the Middle East and so on. That's it's quite an important thing right now. So thanks again very much for this flight and uh, enjoy your free time now. Cool. Bye, okay, thanks. Thank Today was a great take, great flight, very short with the Legacy 650E. Tomorrow we will fly with the Lineage 1000, the bigger brother of the Legacy, exactly. from Karlsruhe to Paris. So like and subscribe and enjoy our flight for tomorrow. <laughs>